On 21st January 2023, we woke up very early in the morning in our friend Dinesh Persai's house. We had traveled the previous evening from Siliguri to meet a very important person in Gantok. So we asked the important person to come and meet us down in Ranipur and he arrived wearing a green mask. We had a very simple plan for the day. We would go around in the car, visit a few places, have lunch and talk about our life. We halted for a while in Living Garden, expecting to drink hot coffee and chat for some time. However, our expectations were not met because the coffee machines were not working as there was no electricity. Instead, we decided to stroll around, click some photos and freely give our reviews about the place to one another. Being the most intelligent and generous of the four, I of course gave it a 5 star rating. I also recommended that Dennis bring all his family members there for a day out. And under no circumstances did we discuss who is going to pay for all the expenses. Two of the guys in this trip are married to women from the Rai community, so it became extremely logical to visit the Paruhang Sapten Mangkhim, which is the International Kirat Rai Linguistic and Cultural Research Center. Now the next time these guys visit their in-laws, somebody will be impressed a lot. This is the perfect example of what we call Modern challenges need modern solutions. We decided that lunch would be in room tech, so we headed uphill along the dusty roads. We talked about the great web series that we have watched and movies that have impressed us. We shared about experiences that have shaped our principles in life and our desire to change certain practices. We disagreed about our theological positions till we agreed that these momos were just awesome. We descended down to Namin village almost unsure if the rough uneven road was worth the trip. At one point we even thought that this was the wrong way. However, like a good metaphor for life, the road became better as we traveled on.
sipping cups of locally brewed hot tea, we watched the sun preparing to set for the day. It was a beautiful view. On the side of the viewpoint, a quotation read, a sweet friendship refreshes the soul. We knew we had arrived the zenith of this trip. We descended down to Rani Pool, where a mela was in full swing and the people were thoroughly enjoying the light and the music. Here we let Mr. Philip Bose go back to his family before we spent a short time there and headed back to Tumlabung. <laughs>